Hey guys, uh, so as 2020 comes to an end, I just wanted to do a fun video uh, about just these random items that I really appreciated of, um, during 2020. Uh, it was a really tough year for a lot of people and you know, I, was, I just thought why not make a video that just kind of sends a message of just appreciating the things that you have in your life. And so yeah, let's dive right in. The first item that I really appreciated this year was um, the Hario V60, uh, the pour over. Uh, I mean, my wife and I just got into pour over this year. It's the fun hobby we got into just to save some money on uh, like our coffee purchases and but the packets that we were using at home just it didn't feel to the quality just didn't cut it for us so we're still learning about coffee but it's been really fun and my love language actually is um, active service and so it's been kind of fun for me to prepare a cup of coffee for my wife or just my mother-in-law who's at home yeah, it's just been a really fun journey and um, looking forward to diving into it deeper uh, this upcoming year. And the second item that I really appreciated is uh, the external flash on my camera. So to be honest, I actually had this since 2000, uh, the early 2010, like maybe 2013. I've had it for over more than seven years and I just never took the time to learn how to use it and but as many of you guys know we just had our son Kai and one of the reasons why I got into photography is to take really good pictures of my kids and um, picture of my family and so yeah like and then my workplace I, um, I started using my camera a little more so I had to learn to how to use external flash so um, yeah, it's been awesome and the pictures that I've been taking have improved a lot significantly. So if you guys were thinking about external flash or have one but haven't been using it that much, I highly recommend and encourage you guys to dive in and just see what you guys can do with it. Look who just woke up, guys. Um, the third item that I really appreciated this year was the Kerbal back support. Um, so, disclaimer, it's like, it's not the most comfortable thing, but um, as of now, my work commute is 50 miles, which takes about an hour and 30 minutes without traffic. And uh, I noticed my po posture while driving is really poor, like, I kind of slouch a lot, but so my wife bought me that back support for me to just kind of place in my driver's seat, and uh, yeah, it's it actually it's not comfortable while driving, but when I get to my destination, my back doesn't feel as rounded and like um, slouchy. So like when I get out of the car, like my back feels pretty upright, my posture feels a little better. So I'm real, I'm I've been really appreciating that. Um, back support. So yeah, that's my item number three. Whew. Uh, item number four <laughs> is a super random one, but it's the toothbrush UV sanitizer. Um, I've always lived in California up until now, but right now I'm living in Korea and humidity is one of the things that just I'm learning to get used to. Um, and the toothbrush that was in my bathroom, just nothing, not that it was anything wrong with it, but it definitely didn't feel as dry as it would have back in California but when I place it in the sanitizer and I take it out like it feels like it feels like new so it was like a whole new world for me so I don't know how scientific and like how like it actually cleans but like it, like feeling wise it definitely feels like cleaner and like um yeah I can never go back so <laughs> Alright guys, so the last random item that we really appreciated this year is... Ta-da! Shinlamyeon Gongyeon! You guys are probably like, what the heck? But, um, so when Yeon was pregnant with Kai, um, we both had these random cravings for ramen, like late nights or 
yeah, just very randomly and but we would feel really guilty or we would just try to avoid it at all costs just because we knew how unhealthy it is and one day when we were walking by the convenience store we saw this and it said non-frying so we're like you know what maybe this is this is okay so uh, we gave it a try and yes, it was really good like I would say it's my favorite still and yeah like uh, so there you have it uh, Five random items that we appreciated um, during 2020. Um, just, I know these random items I would have just taken for granted if I didn't take the time to reflect back on being being thankful for the things that I had this year. Um, so I hope this video encourage you guys encourages you guys to um, look back in the things that you have already and um, just to have a um, heart of gra uh, heart of gratitude. So yeah. Uh, thank you for watching, and uh, we'll see you guys next time. Bye! Bye! <laughs>